Welcome to Smart Matching, which is introducing smart people. Let me introduce you Paolo Giacchi, which is here with us, our smart person of today. Oh, thank you. Paolo, we are talking about material. We are looking to find new material for the upcoming season. What are you looking for right now? Well, I, as you know, I'm working uh, mostly outside of Italy and mostly China, Russia and uh, other countries. In general, I feel uh, uh, clients uh, wants uh, technology as a first step. Want to introduce the word of sustainability. So how to make the project technological? I think good with nature. Let me talk about which project are you following right now? So uh, I'm focused very much to create young space. I feel uh, uh, clients request uh, young design. It means uh, technology, as I said, and uh, the trend that I feel now is more minimalistic in order also to save. Because another thing that clients want now is to save, save money and time. And probably space, new space has to be faster. So this is the mix. Young, technological and sustainability is the ingredient of the shop of the future. Interesting. And you also talk about China, Russia, completely different mindset of country. How can you balance the combination between the material you're looking for and the local culture. Everybody look in the same direction today. I mean, uh, communication, uh, internet, Instagram uh, makes the country looks in the same direction. It's, uh, if I had to build a fashion shop in Russia or in Cyprus or in Italy is more or less the same language. So it's me that I desire, and I think is interesting, to give a touch of local, because I feel the need to add a touch of local things in each design, in each project. But the language today is the same. How can I express the language to a material? Of course, each architect, uh, each designer has a different style and different approach. Uh, I love the contrast. So, in terms of material, I love to mix hot and cold, raw and smooth, like leather or soft textile, to mix with raw material. I think that's the beauty of the project. You talk about the shop of the future, but we are under the pandemic. How much is the influence of the material in a shop in this specific moment? But I don't feel so much relation with the specific moments in terms of material. I would say that uh, um, there is an influence in the world that is, uh, is running from east to west uh, and uh, as I said, uh, uh, the channel of communication today is super fast. So my clients in Russia is well prepared as my clients in Milano is the same. Probably 20 years ago was not like this, but today is this. In terms of material, usually uh, I show my proposal to my clients. So maybe the client has a, an idea. I transform this idea with my design in real materials. So 
I'm the person who push for one material or another one. However, clients has a direction in the mind. You said you, you're looking for technology. Then you love the contrast between the... The contrast. How, how can you combine the two things? Technology is fashion. So when you introduce technology, and it would be nice uh, to introduce also certain material, as we said before, like leather, for example. Try to introduce digitalization into leather or vice versa, okay, leather into the digital. I don't know how to do it, but of course it's something that uh, would be super fascinating. I think uh, uh, technology is the hottest things today in the design, definitely. It's, it means young, it means new, it means modern, contemporary, I mean, it means everything. Then uh, uh, materials, I think I'm well prepared, probably better than technology. And uh, this aspect of the raw and the smooth, uh, I think is the salt of the project, is the beauty, I mean, is uh, everything. So we had to mix and match, mix and match and try the key of the new projects. So surfaces is more than design. Surface is everything. So today you can have an empty space, but super cool in terms of surface. So we should play a lot. I mean, the industry should work a lot on surfaces because Going into more minimal world of the design, I think a surface makes the real difference. Make the sense, make the emotion. Emotion, definitely. And sophistication and quality and uh, the sense that I prove when I touch something. That's give me more emotion than any other objects. Sustainability today is a must. Uh, and I think this is one of the reasons also that we go back to the raw materials. So raw materials equal sustainability. It means uh, raw leather, raw cement, raw glass. I mean, the material at the origin. I think uh, this mix with warm materials create emotion. Okay, so sustainability is also uh, <clears throat> works well with my kind of design, definitely. I like uh, unfinished products and this is beautiful. Okay, the, the word unfinished is super fascinating, I think, because it gives you already the idea of something nude, something pure.